video is because I wanted to make it about how um, the developers at War Gaming or um, other tanks. It's just how they ruined the Churchill 3. Churchill 3 tier 5 premium from Russia. Well, it's British, but whatever. My point is, it used to be really good because back when I first started my channel, the first World of Tanks video I made was with, like, and the first video I had, like, the first tank I used was a T-34. But the Churchill 3 was much better back then because you when you're in the tier when you're in the tier five, you only play up until tier six. But now they've ruined it by making it so that if you're in a tier five, you're playing with tier sevens. So what I'm saying is, if you're in Panzer three slash four, let's say, you'll be in with Kraft's fucking Panther. A sniping panther. But yeah. So my main point here is the well the, the developers of all the tanks should really like sort their shit out because having a tier seven in with a tier fucking six or no a five, that's not fair. Like it's like taking a tier six VK three um for oh hang on. Say you're in this, the downgraded panther. You take it out for a game, and then you're in the fucking this. You're in the ram panzer. What do you do? I tell you what you do. You drive off a cliff and commit suicide because you can't fight that thing because of its armor. So let's take a look here. Armor viewer. Oh, would you look at that? The front's basically, like... 200 plus millimeters thick. Let's take a look at the downgraded panther, shall we, folks? Oh, wait, no, the wrong one. Wow. You know, that it just annoys me the way that they put you in with side armor that's like 50 millimeters thick and turret ring that's only like 100 millimeters thick. No, even less than 100, to be honest, because look. It only goes up to there. And that's just the front turret ring and everything. And that's a tier 6. And they play up to tier 8. How lovely is that? So yeah. Skill based matchmaking has ruined World of Tanks completely. Because I'm just so sick and tired of going in with Tiger 217. Or no, Tiger 131. 131, sorry, I might piss off a bunch of World War 2 fans, but whatever. I'm tired of going in with that, and then facing off against the higher ranked Tiger, Tiger 2, with the 131. There's just no point, you can't fight it. But yeah, also, the reason why I was saying about the Churchill 3 earlier, saying stuff about the Churchill 3 earlier, is because, well, let's take a look at this, shall we? Tier 5 plays up to tier 6. But then, why are we in? Why is me and my dad in with fucking tier 8s? Or tier 7s or whatever. Why are we in with tier 7s with a 2 pounder gun tank? What's wrong with you, War or, um, World of Tanks developers? How is this fair fighting with a tier 5 Churchill? up against a tier 7 Churchill 7 what how is that even fair what process do you go through in your mind to think a tier 5 is going to face off against a tier 7 it won't it'll end with either being blown up to pieces or managing to escape by a thread of health so yeah this has been more of a ranting video on my channel. You can call it whatever you want, ranting, review, whatever. But the main problem is, if we're playing with tier 7s in that, and let's, let's look at this thing's armor to be honest, let's look, let's look. The thickest piece of armor on it is a hundred something millimeters, and that's just around the small gun. So... 
That's when the small gun, and I've used this tank several times before, every bullet on me just instantly goes through my armor. It's just, there's just no point. If I ricochet something, I'm considering myself the luckiest man alive in that tank because nothing ricochets on it. Yeah, let's see that compared to a tier 7, shall we, game? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. So, tier 7. Alright, Tiger 131. That thing's maximum armor is like 100 millimeters, right? Ouch. This thing has, has 135 millimeters and to 160. Ooh, ow. With 100 millimeter thick armor. So, how is that? How is 131? Like, how is the fight gonna go with that and one f and a Churchill 3? I'll tell you what will happen. It'll end with an explosion and pieces of Russian looking metal everywhere. And 131's just gonna be sat in the background with a gun that's smoking a lot. But yeah, so that's just been my kind of rant, so. If the developers of World of Tanks do watch this, I have tried to make a report to you about the bloody um, skill with matchmaking be being a complete slob. And they just said, oh, you can text us about this, but there's not a chance we'll get you back about it. It's like, oh, fine. Thanks a lot. Fucking wankers. Alright, so this has been my ranting video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And, uh, yeah, hopefully they actually get their shit together and do a bit better job at doing, uh, skill with matchmaking. Or, um, tier ranked matchmaking. But yeah, so that's, that's been today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and, uh, trying to get blown up to a million pieces by an IS-3. Have a good day.